teach you. Um, so anyways, today we have um, our lesson on New York City Transit. It's basically the way um, that you get around in New York. Um, so a lot of people take the train, the bus, the subway. So we'll be talking about that a lot. Um, so for yeah. the for the warm up, we have um, do you take the train or bus? Yeah. So um, uh, I normally I take the bus, but I drive to work every day. You drive, okay. Um, once in a yeah. while you'll take the bus. Yeah. Yeah. Over here, I take mm -hmm. the I I take the bus a lot. Um. Sometimes when I'm home, I'll take the train to get into New York City. Um, uh, in order for me to get to work, I walk. It's close. Um, the store, I have to drive. I don't have a car, but my friend does. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Anyways, let's go on to the reading. Um, so that's on the next page. You could start reading, and I'll tell you if anything's mispronounced. Okay, um, the Metropolitan Transition Authority is the New York City's public transportation agency. It is the largest public transportation in North America. To use the service, all you need to do is to purchase a metro card. You can use a metro card to get on an MTA bus or subway train. It is convenient to use because the MAT operates around the clock 24 hours a day seven days a week you can use it to travel to any borough of new york city yeah nice job borough yep that's a good one um and it's the mta uh, borough yep yeah. and it's the mta i think you said m-a-t <laughs> <laughs> sorry sir I, I didn't notice that mta yeah that's okay i do that too sometimes um, and what's, the, <laughs> what's that second word that's in the paragraph? Um, metropolitan. The, yeah, so it's the metropolitan. Metropolitan. Oh, I made a mistake in the stress. Metropolitan. Uh, yeah, so it's the, the stress is on the third syllable, metropolitan. Okay, metropolitan, thanks. Yep, so... Um, we have a question of comprehension here. Um, so, yeah. what do you need in order to use the MTA? Um, I need a metro card. Yep. Uh, and then, so some of the vocabulary is um, agency, which is basically the business, um, the mm -hmm. people that sell the metro cards. Um, then the second word we have is operate, which means works. So, um, the metro... Yeah the metro operates 24 7. the metro is you could use it any time of the day um even in the mm -hmm. even at midnight um and then the last word is burrow um burrow is basically burrow. yeah it's it's a little weird to say right burrow um it's it's a neighborhood of the city so um brooklyn is a borough of new york um manhattan so just to be clear, do you want to make a sentence with one of the um, vocabulary words? Um, operate. Um, the subway agency operates from 6 to 11 in Guiyang every day. Nice job. Um, <laughs> okay, let's move on to the next reading. Okay. Um, MTA buses transport 2.4 million riders daily and 764 million annually. Riders wait for the bus at a bus stop. Once the bus pulls up to the stop, the doors will open and the riders can board. The riders will then pay the bus fare by flipping their metro card into the fare box. The rider can request to get off the bus by pressing the stop button or pushing the yellow tape screen. Yeah, nice job. Perfect. Um, how does a rider pay for the bus? They drop their metro card into the fare box. Yep. 
Um, so some of the vocab we have here is annually, which means it happens yeah, every year. Every yeah. year, yeah. So like the spring festival, mm -hmm. it's an annual festival. It happens every year. Yeah. Um, yeah. The the second word is board. Um, so if I board a train, mm -hmm. I board a plane, I get onto it. I get onto the train. Yeah. And then the last mm -hmm. word is request. It just means to ask for something. Okay. Do you want to make a sentence with one of the words? Um, we have a party for the new year annually. Yep, we have a party for the new year annually. So you guys have this party yeah. every year. Yes. Nice job. Yeah. Okay, now on to the next reading. You could start okay, whenever you're page. ready. Yep. Okay. Uh, more than 5.6 million people work on the subway a day and over 1.7 billion a year. To use the subway, you must first enter a subway station. Then you swipe your metro card at the turnstile. Walk through the turnstile when the screen says go. Wait on the subway platform. Then the train when it arrives. Nice job. Um, and so how do you use the turnstile? Um, we sweep our metro cards at the turnstile and then we can walk through it when the script says go. Yep, perfect. Um, so a turnstile <laughs> is, uh, do you see that picture um, on the top right? Yeah. Mm. That's a turnstile. Yeah. That's a turnstile. It's a little gate that you enter. Um, they use mm -hmm. it for security, you know, just in case that, just so just to be insure, just to be sure that you paid, um, for your yeah. ticket. Uh, and then the last word we have is platform. Platform is the is the little place that you wait on, um, before entering the train. It's like an elevated platform, a, a raised platform. Um, yeah. Do you want to make a sentence? Um, before we get on a bus, we have to wait at the platform for minutes. Yep. Perfect. Um, okay. Let's go to the comprehension. So basically just read out the sentence and I'll, and then just say if it's true or false. Okay. A, V, M, T, A, M, T, V, M, T, V or M, T, A. <laughs> Yeah. The MTA is New York City's public transportation agency. That's true. So it's the M the use M the metro card to ride the bus or train. That's true. The yeah. Um the MTA does not operate on the weekends. That's not true. It operates twenty four hours a day and seven days a week. Yeah. Um um, New York City's transit system is the largest in the North America. That's for sure. That's true. Yep. Okay. Swipe your metro card at the turnstile to board the bus. I think that's that's the way you get on the subway. That's false. Yeah, on the bus you need to. Um, there's like a. I think there was a little. To drop your metro card into the fare box. You swipe it. Yeah. Um, into the fare box. Yeah, and the first one is, yeah. um, it's supposed to be the MTA, so that one's false. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you got yeah. that, though. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay, now let's go on to the next comprehension section. Okay. Um, she made a request to a new job. Uh, number two, the MTA operates 24 hours a day. Sorry, what did you say number for one? Three, First one? Yeah, what was that? Um, made a request for. Oh, for, I yeah. That's for. Yeah, yeah, it's for. Yep. Okay. Um, the third one 1.7 billion people ride on a train annually. It's adverb. Yep. Number four. Wait on the subway, turnstile, go. Wait for wait on the subway platform for the train. Platform. Yep. Okay, number five. New York City is made up of five boroughs. That's 
B. Burroughs, Second yeah. Second choice. Um, the riders wait for the bus at the bus stop. Yep, perfect. All right, let's yeah. move on to the discussion. So, um, let's talk about the NYC Transit. What do you think of it? Yeah. Uh, it's it's convenient because it uh, it operates um, twenty four hours a day. And it helps to save a lot of money for people who can't buy a car. And it's also safer if we take some way because we can get rid of traffic accidents sometimes. But um, sometimes it might be a waste of time because you have to wait for your bus or subway. But if you have a car, you can go anywhere, anytime. Yep, that's very true. Um, so I you yeah. got it you got into number two as well. So some of the advantages are <laughs> that's okay. So some yeah. of the advantages are mm-hmm. that it's really convenient, like you said. Um, disadvantages you could miss mm-hmm. your stop. You could um, you could um, it might take a while. You have to wait. Um, yeah. But it's nice because public transportation it saves the environment. Um, you know the, yeah. there's more people in one vehicle. Um, so with that being said, let's move on to number three. Um, is it common to use public transportation in your city? Yeah, it's, it's very common. Yeah. So over here, it's common to use the bus because I don't, I don't live in New York city. I live, um, right now I go to school upstate, which is like north of the city. Um, so it's a little more, um, is not as populated, so uh, we don't have a metro here. Um, so more people use like the bus. Um, yeah, it's really just the bus that a lot of people take. Um, so it, the bus is fairly common, but obviously we don't have a metro. Um, okay, number four. So should transit fare be affordable? Uh, it should be because it serves the public and not not everyone can afford to buy a car so most of people would try to go to work or go to stores by taking public transportation and if if it is too expensive i think people will not take the public transit as often as they can why not they just buy a car yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, transit fare should be affordable because it should be like that last option. You know, what if your car breaks down? Then you have to pay for an expensive fare, you know? Yeah. That's not good. Um, and yeah. I definitely agree. Like, you have to... People that can't afford a car, they should be able to be... be they should be able to afford um, the subway. Um, also... Mm-hmm. If, if the subway is too expensive, they're just going to take their car and then the environment suffers. Yeah. So, yeah. you make a good point. Um, okay, well that sums up our lesson. Um, I hope this helps. Um, I'm going to be sending you a survey based on how you thought the lesson went. Um, so make sure you fill it out. Um, and as for that, I'll see you next time, alright? It was nice meeting you. Okay. Bye. Nice to meet you too. Yeah, same. Thanks. Bye.